Hello, I'm Alison Crocker and in my last video cast we talked about numerology, the power and energy of numbers and how we can use them to um, bring change and um, benefits to our lives. We looked at the life path number. The life path number is um, derived from the date of birth. Life paths are all about um, vocational and career choices and also talents and our abilities. Um, and we can obviously use our life path to make sensible career choices and make sure that we're in a job um, or vocation that we actually enjoy rather than one that we don't. The date of birth that we use was the 30th of March 1952. Adding up this um, date of birth came to um, the figures 23 and when we add, because we always add and use the single figure when it's life path, um, if you add two and three together you get five and we talked about number five being ruled by Mercury, it's the planet of communication which means that fives are really good communicators or need a, a vocation or a job where they're really good at communicating, sort of like sales rep or something where communication is really important. But obviously there are other numbers because we're looking at numbers from one to nine. There are others but we'll go into that at a later date. Um, Let's look at number one. Number one is very much the number of the innovator. Um, it's uh, the beginning number, so they're good at creating new beginnings. Um, it's the number of um, the innovator, so inventions and all about new discoveries. Um, it's also the number of leadership. Um, and number ones tend to be very determined in, in what they do because it's obviously first, number one, they have to be first. Um, it's also a very courageous number. Number one, it's usually kind of like, because it stands alone, um, number one, um, they're obviously uh, using skills um, where kind of like their decisions and choices are first and foremost, hence first, the number one. It's also the number of leadership and um, the individual. So these, um, if, if you have the birth date and you add up all your, um, the digits in the birth date and you are a number one, you're um, very skilled at innovation. Um, you're a very driven character, an individual. Um, it's a really good number to have. Um, looking at number two, if adding up your um, date of birth, uh, your final figure comes to number two. Number two are all about balance and harmony. Um, it's very patient and a cooperative number. Um, they're very sensitive. Um, they're very good at compromise. So um, two careers and professions would be anybody that's um, needed to rely on their care skills because it's a very caring number. Um, it's, it's a good number to have if you want to do nursing or any career where kind of looking after people um, or a vet looking after animals is, is, is very important. And we'll just talk about one more number today and that number is number three. I like number three. It's a really good creative number. They're usually artistic, creative, um, usually very skilled at drawing. Um, it's also um, called the forever young number. Threes tend to look younger than what they actually are, which is a good thing when you get to a certain age. Um, and they're also very inspirational. Um, they have a gift with words. They're very good at writing or speaking. Um, and um, creativity is very important if your uh, life path is a number three. Um, join me again next time and we'll talk about numbers a bit more. Thanks.